Hey guys, what's up? This is Gom, and welcome to Splatoon 3 on the Nintendo Switch, begrudgingly still on the Nintendo Switch. Give me a new console already, Nintendo. But alright, let's go ahead and make our character. Uh, we can be- I like I like how the model where it barely changes in all of this. It's like, I can be a squid, I can be an octoling. I think we're gonna stay as a squid. Always enjoy playing as the squid. Oh. Whoa, whoa! Hold up, why don't we get more eye, eye colors like these bottom ones? Haircut. They have super expanded their hair choices, holy hell. We'll go with the, uh... We'll go with the first one, honestly. I, I like the, like, half-braid look. How about the brows? Um... We'll do these ones. Leg wear! What do we got? Why does this have three dots under it? I don't know. Well, we'll do with the... I like this skirt with shorts under it look. I am happy with this, yes. Alright, we got a little chicken thing. Little buddy's turn, alright. What are we gonna do with you? I think I'll just give him the spiky mohawk. Think you're fresh? Start splatting and we'll see. Before you hit the crater, we'll hit you with the basics. Oh gosh, what if I don't... Can I turn this off immediately? Not yet. Alright, fine. They have, they have a start with uh, motion controls. I'm surprised this little tutorial is still kind of here. Because this was in the Splatfest demo slash beta as well. Found a gun in a box. Yeah, I know how this goes. I've been splatting for years. It also helps that I, uh, recently went through the Octoling expansion, you know, a little bit of a practice before everything, before Splatoon 3 comes out. <laughs> Onward to Splatsville, City of Chaos. That sounds scary. <laughs> I'm surprised some of these fish people are out here. And this jellyfish guy, I feel like they would need to have like consistent water source nearby. Versus being in a desert. But we'll assume the train is air conditioned. My frame rate, it's gone. I love Nintendo. It's a company that doesn't believe in 30 FPS either. <laughs> 
It's like, we can make the city run at like 20 FPS, whatever. It looks pretty. All right. The snap, it's going down. Wrapping the Splatlands, we are deep cut. Oh god, god, I hate when it goes so fast. You lip sync, we dripping. Ay, 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 shiver frying big man. Let's see the current battle stages. All right, what do we got for our first day? Hagglefish Market, Hammerhead Bridge. And a whole bunch of other stuff. Always keep your cool in battle. When the enemy goes floomp, you go kagloomp. What she said. What does kagloomp mean? All right, what's your go-to stress reliever? Scrap with a whole bunch of salmonoids. Works every time. Yeah, I can agree with that. Salmon run's kind of fun. Breaking news, hot off the press. Oh, you got something, big man? Let's hear it. Uh, this was my story to break. The great sapfish is gone. Again? It basically powers the whole city. We need it back soon or it's lights out. Time to conserve. Turn off lights and set the temp to a cool 90 degrees Fahrenheit. That is... That is not cool. That's 32 degrees Celsius, and it is not cool. Call us if you find the zapfish. And that's it for now. Ooh, spicy. For Splatsville, that's a wrap. Catch you later. <laughs> Goodbye. I just moved here and you're telling me the shitty's in a dire situation? Gosh. Welcome to Splatsville. This is the place to see and be seen, the hottest spot on the map. If you want to make it in this town, you gotta be your freshest. And how do you show off your extremely fresh self? Online battles! Just hit up the lobby. Seriously, if you start making waves in battles, everyone around here will know your name. No, they won't. Wait, what? You're new here, and I don't mean to alarm you, but that dude is seriously scoping you from the sewer. Captain Goldfish? Whatever, it's fishy, but we'll get to that later. So, where were we? Oh, right, battles. Time to sink into the ink. If you want to get right to it, check the lobby. Or follow that weirdo down the sewer. Up to you. Go get him. Full splat ahead. All right. We're fucking first things first as I'm turning off motion controls. I'm good. I'm good. I, li I like being able to look up and down with my analog stick. Just, you know, they should just let us use mouse and keyboard. Then I wouldn't need to worry about uh, motion controls because I would just have straight controls. Holy, I'm non-binary and also severely attracted to women. Shout out to trans people also. I get this entirely. Fresh. All right, we're going in the campaign. That's what we're here for. Cuttlefish? Do I have to... <laughs> okay. I thought we were going to talk to him. How'd the Eiffel Tower go upside down? There are are the Octarians are coming again. No, no, die. Did we do this once before? The old noggin ain't what it used to be. It's okay, man. I know you're like 130 years old. Anyway. The name's Cuttlefish, senior advisor to the new Squid Beak Splatoon, at your service. That look in your eye, it's the look I've been looking for. The great Zapfish that's power Splatsville has been squidnapped. <laughs> it's the Octarians again. You can bet your bottom sand dollar on it. See, the great Zapfish has gone missing before. Twice, in fact. Those ugly jerks are behind it both times! There is a pattern there, you're right. I'm gonna keep an eye on them even though I'm technically retired. And with eyes like these, there ain't much that escapes me. Your eyes are pretty large, yeah. Well, they still made off with the great zapfish. And now we've got to get it back, right? So, uh... <laughs> I'll, I'll help you, man. I'm down for it. That was a job I for kid. The pay is zero. Uh, but you you might just save the world. You're in, right? Right? Of course you are. It's 
John Day, you are Agent 3 of the new Squid Beak Platoon. This is your brand new hero suit. It'll help you fight the Octarians. Uh, isn't there already an Agent 3? Huh. Is there such a thing as something growing in the wash? It's a little baggy on you. Honey, I don't remember you ever washing it. Bah. The last Agent 3 was clean as a catfish. Yeah. Oh, let's go get those octoclowns. I'm counting you. Oh, you've already got another agent there with you, huh? Well, I'm fresh out of hero suits, unfortunately. That's all right. My little dude, he can just he can roam around in the nude. Oh, but it's a little salty, a little scamp, ain't it? It'll do fine. Now, where was I? All right. Let's go get those octo jerks. I'm counting on you, bucko. You got it, Captain Cuttlefish. A little weird that we've repurposed Agent 3's number. Because, like, what happened to Agent 3? Alright, let's look for a way into the Octaria base. Keep your ears open for my nuggets of wisdom. I'll keep my eyes open for your nuggets of wisdom. What is this? Take a gander at that! It's a portrait of the new Squid Beaks Platoon's captain! Not a bad likeness, eh? Oh, Agent 3's no longer an Agent 3, a captain now. The captain was Agent 3 before you were Agent 3. Agent 3? Nothing complicated about it! You... You know about the captain, right? Um, what? Well, I suppose we were a secret squad, doing our heroing outside of the public eye. How could you know? I wanted him to, set, to give us more information. Yeah, of course I know about the captain. I knew it! The captain's a real celebrity. You know, I used to be a captain, right? Yeah, never mind that. But how's that likeness looking? It looks great! It's a masterpiece. Thanks for the input, kiddo. Let me know what you want me to... Uh, when you want me to immortalize you. I love that you can... <laughs> Randomly just change it's Agent 3. Whoa. Mind the fuzzy ooze that's all over the place. Touch that stuff and who knows what'll happen. Alright, I know what'll happen. Floof. Instant full body beard, whether you want it or not. That doesn't sound too appealing. Man, I love that you can just change Agent 3 over and over and over again throughout all these games. Okay, now that is one big pile of fuzzy ooze. That big old bubble on top is probably the fuzzball. I bet if you could pop that, the whole thing would poof, disappear. But I doubt you ain't gonna do the trick. Yeah, let's worry about that later. For now, keep looking for a way into the Octarium base. All right. Hey, little guy, where, where are we going, huh? You interested in this thing over here? There. And Kettle ought to take us right to him. Shoot the lid with ZR and blow it open. But what the hell is this? Oh. It's like a little view tower. Ooh, this whole place can use a shave, or a shower, or whatever cleans up fuzzy ooze. Looks like we're gonna be doing a whole lot of descending. All right. Number one, Octarians in the crater, yikes. Here we go! It's the real deal, Agent 3! Yeah, I'm ready. I, uh, I don't, I'm just gonna shoot everything. Take a good look around. You see something you wanna ink? Press ZR and fire away! Yeah, I, I'm collecting as much as I can. So I'm curious, uh, if you get discombobulated, you can reset the camera with Y. It's a real neat trick. The real question is, what can my little dude do? Because if we look at my ink bar right there, right? He's on there. Oh, shit. I could throw him like a little grenade. What? <laughs> hey, that's a launch pad. Hop on and buckle up. Let's rumble. Clambo, that was something, wasn't it? Those are called balloon fish. They go kablooey when you pop them. Yeah, I know, man. 
I'm an experienced agent, you just don't remember. Alright, looks like you found a splat switch. Go ahead and splat and see what happens. I imagine it makes a bridge. Yeah. Looking at a faraway crate and dreaming? Maybe your small prop button can help. Try pressing R. Whoa. Nice. Wow, that crate never stood a chance. Good job, small fry. That must be what the little pop-up icon is. Maybe not. This is funky, I like it. <laughs> Try to split just so. Aim carefully with the crosser in the middle of your screen. Yeah, I know how this works, cuttlefish. Ah, oh, you found some armor. Slap that down, they'll give you some protection against enemy ink. Nice. Yeah. Don't fall into the abyss. I need you, little buddy. Yeah, they really need to do a better job securing the zapfish, huh? Oh, there's our first Octarian. Yeah, Octo Trooper ahead. It's a real live enemy. Get ready to splat with ZR Engine 3. You got it. Real quick before you engage. When the going gets tough, the tough behind walls. No shame in it. Oh, yeah, I'm I know all about cover. Yeah. <laughs> Giddy up. That was splatastic. Didn't know I can rely on small fry any- Whoa, shit! To help us out. That's a zapfish! Ink up that force field to a burst and then bring it home! Hi, right, little zapfish! Hey, how you doing? Come with me! First time bonus, 500! Woo! Well done, Agent 3. You remind me of a young cuttlefish, heroically saving the day. Anyway, the good news is you got a zapfish. They're a source of energy on their own. But the better news is that this great zapfish may be up ahead. Are they related? Are they like little babies of the great zapfish? That part I'm not, you know, made clear on. You know, the hero suit fits you just fine. Kids these days like things, um... Uh, things like uh, things a little baggy, don't they? Yeah, you know, there's some very fi fashion senses. It's nice that you got a little buddy with you throughout all this. When all this is over, maybe we ought to think about some security for the great zapfish. Yeah, dude, after everything that's happened. All right, I plumb forgot about all this fuzzy use. And that blast of fuzzballs just wobbling back and forth, taunting us. Is that your small fry buddy chirping about something? You know, that species is rumored to have a big reaction to power eggs. Anything's worth a shot, right? Try pressing R to power up your little buddy with some power eggs. Alright. Well, that did something. Try throwing up the fuzzball. Oh. Look at that! He gobbled up the goose like it was nothing. That little monster has quite an appetite. Anyway, it cleared the path for you. Go on. Nice. All right, so we just, uh, we, <laughs> we throw this little guy at all the fuzzballs to clear out the level. Much obliged, little buddy. What about this? 
Does that lead to a whole nother level? Whoa. Hello, oh, Rascal Go! Think there's something worth checking out nearby? Yeah, look, there's like a little fan thing. Whoa. You got decoration. Hey, it looks like you found a loot anchor. Anytime you find one of those, splat it up for a fun surprise. Cool. Very nice. Sink into the ink and swim. I mean, I guess I could do a little bit of swimming. What we got here? Ooh, hey, that's a lot of, uh, the, the stage already been pre-inked by quite a bit. Now's the time to squid after it. Press ZL to bloop into the ink and start swimming. Remember, you can jump with B. Ugh. Yeah, what is that? We have, like, a lock-on feature, but I have no idea if that's what that's for, really. I thought, like, maybe... I thought that maybe Small Fry would pick up anything that's highlighted, but no. Hey, those are dash tracks. Go on them and you'll go flying. Woo! Oh, wait, hold on. I, I actually want, I want, I want the ones over here. You're not getting away, little friend. Messed up. Uh, okay. I'm about to say, well, this has been a circle. Oh, wow. Ooh, ooh. Yeah. I grabbed that zap fish and skedaddle. You gotta tell me, man. Ready on my way out. Ah, small fry's so silly looking. Nicely done, Agent 3. But those Octarians look different. They used to be a little more smooth, if memory serves. Hey, I ain't one to judge a deadly tentacle creature by its cover. More power to him! Uh, but not really. Anyhow, as long as you're sporting that hero suit, you can stand up to any Octarian, bearded or not. Did you even read the label? Here, I'll do it for you. You're wearing the latest in apocalyptic survival fashion. Avoid enemies and navigate the Splatland style with your own high-end sensor. Dry clean only. You gotta learn everything about your gear! That's another battle test to rule the battlefield. Well, what the hell is a high-end sensor? <laughs> we gotta get the great Zapfish back from those Octarian bugs. Yeah, I'm working on it slowly and surely. Yeah. Careful here, it's a long way down and one false step would send you over the edge. Yeah, that doesn't look good for me. Looks kind of like a boss arena, honestly. You gonna jump down there? Make sure you got a safe place to land. Don't worry, I didn't even have to look at where I was going.
Number three. Box is loaded. Keys, please. Or box is locked. Sorry. Box is locked. Keys, please. They're gonna teach me about the key mechanic. Again. You wanna get to inside that vault? You gotta find the key. There it is. Grab that key and unlock the vault. There you go. Now I think of that thing in my box. Aha! You activate Nick Rail. Hop on and ride ZL. Now don't panic, but if you let go ZL, you'll fall to your doom. So hold on tight. Yeah, that doesn't exactly make someone not panic. Don't panic, but if you fall, you'll die. Well, 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 another vault. Find the key. There she glows. I can see the zapfish from here. Oh, yeah, look at that. There's our goal. Easy peasy. All right, we need to set up the ink rails. Octocopter spotted! Ink it up! I won't do that. I'll let my buddy take it out. I don't know if he failed to kill it or if there was a second one. Remember, you can slip under grades by pressing ZL. Don't worry, old man. I've got these mechanics down, Pat. But I get it, you know, you gotta... We're doing, you know, we gotta introduce the newer mechanics to the people who haven't played Splatoon. Splatoon 3 is some people's first Splatoon. And those people might be kids. Oh, good idea, old man. If your ink won't reach, it's ball fries time to shine. It's, it's good, small fry, you're... You don't have to do money more. How do I get up there, though? Try as you might, I don't think you're gonna be able to hop out of the ink row from here. Mm. Oh. Okay. Maybe we go up this way. Aha! Think you can jump from one egg round to another? It's worth a shot. Don't worry, I've got it covered. Alright. We're outy! Why is there a giant bed there? I mean, obviously we have like the giant TVs, the giant TV cars. But the bed set? Why? Small Fry looks like he's trying to eat the Zapfish every single time. He better not betray us. Keep it up, Agent 3. You're making me proud. Now, I don't want to ruffle your tentacles any further than they've already been a ruffle, but those fuzzy Octarians are freaking me out. I think we ought to consider calling some backup. Hey, let me just fire up that old communicator. Check, check. This is Cuttlefish. Over. Do you copy? It's probably gonna be Shiver or something. Agent 2 here. Over. Wait, Gramps? Is that you? Where are you? Oh, okay. Agent 1, this is Agent 2. Gramps has wandered off again. Over. Well, what are we waiting for, Agent 2? Let's go collect him. Roger that. Stay fresh. Callie, Mari. Did, did they just hang up on me? Agents these days, am I right? So impatient. God damn it, this old thing's busted. Oh well. Come on, let's go. Is that Octa DJ Octavius again? I'm pretty sure that was the name of the villain from the first game and the second game. Oh uh, yeah, pack of cards. Oh right, their card game thing. Yeah. <laughs> you can pick up your cards at the lobby terminal and use them to play table turf battle. Woo! A loot anchor there. You've got a good eye. Those things can be hidden anywhere. That small fry might be a goofball, but I'd follow its nose if I were you. Well, he's kind of just chilling out right now. Come on, buddy. 
Why, why'd you get out of my inventory? If you're not going to lead me around. Aww. Big yawn. I guess he just doesn't want to be in this little... little sack right now. Oh my god! Oh, dude, that stuff was trouble. Stick to the ink if you want to avoid another close shave. Yeah, Jesus. Okay, we gotta be more careful around this. Ugh. Ugh, I was getting a little nervous there. Yeah, I wasn't, but I did get cocky. I'm just full steam ahead. It. What are they? Can we stop them? Look, the Octarians, just because they're a little fuzzy, doesn't mean that they're more powerful. This place is packed with Octarians. Take aim and take them out. Hey, don't worry. I can handle them. You might make good use out of those walls. See if you can get any closer. I don't need walls. Heads up, Agent 3, your special gauge is full. Press the right analog stick for splash down. Yeah, I guess I could start using them. I like to save my specials for more specific scenarios, but we've gotten it so many times and haven't been using it. You think they're just jumping in there? Be careful. Looks like you activated some kind of pillar. Yeah, by accident. That's all right. Looks free and clear up ahead. And that sets off my alarm bells. Be careful, Agent 3. Yeah, I'm sure there's enemies just in the ink, yeah. Huh? I knew it. That won't be the last of them. You can count on that. Stay on your toes. Oh, he's baiting them! Oh, There's always at least one more hiding out. That's a cuttlefish guarantee. Hey, you're right. Well, that looks like you got a whole mess of pillars moving. Yeah, I probably have to, like, hop on them one by one, don't I? Or not. Oh, shit. I'm up. Swash down! <laughs> Easy peasy. Where are the challenges that Agent 8 had to face? And where is Agent 8? I doubt Agent 8's a captain. <laughs> You're on a roll. Nicely done, Agent 3. That ought to be the last kettle, but do you see anything else that looks fishy around here? Oh, uh, yeah, the massive fur just sitting around. One thousand! Oops. Well, at least... <laughs> at least we can get him back. Damn! I hear music. Here come! Something's headed this way first! Oh god, it's Octavius, isn't it? I don't remember what voice I gave him. I've finally found you, Cuttlefish! More Octarian troops have gone missing! But I know you're behind it! There he blows! It's DJ Octavio! Oh, it's Octavio, not Octavius. My bad. After your old tricks, eh? 
If the great Zapfish back! Engine 3, this dirty DJ is the headline of the entire Octarian army. Take him out! First, we will not shut up. I'm about to drop my latest hit. Right on your smoke, little face! Octobot King L3, jeez. Alright, DJ Octavio. Although I have got a feeling that, yeah, he doesn't know what the hell's going on either. Here, come and punch! Shoot it back towards him! Oh! <laughs> Almost got smackified. He's using a drill punch! Quick dodge! It's tough, now's the time for ink! Come on, DJ Octavia, you gotta do a little bit better than that. These are too easy. Yeah! Like, small fry! Octavia fell out of his turntable. Quick, turn the tables on him! Oh, I like your style, cuttlefish. I do like turning the tables on him. Take my beat, sucker! Then you'll love this! Yo, he's sucking my ink up! And his ink up! Yo, hey, that ain't cool. Woo! He's using an ink bag! Don't let it suck up your ink! That's a problem. That ink bag's a real pain in the port! And you throw something in there and jam it up? Yeah, small fry. <laughs> I was already thinking about it. No, bad vacuum. You're doing a good job, small fry. You're not going to get sucked all the way up in there. This flying form looks really cool, though. Whoops, small fry got launched back out. The professors are going to my mark. Hey, be nice to Small Fry. He's my buddy. Anyways, you can have him back. Way to plug him up, Small Fry. I feel bad for the little run, but it worked. Not good enough to fucking... It was still deflecting my ink. For a little bit there. But I guess that's because it hit the ground. Hey, Octavio! Octavio's out, that's your chance! Yeah, I get it. Rules of three. Oh, no, you make me mad! He's slapping the ink away? Oh, he's real steam now. Keep your guard up. Oh, he's gonna slap me! Oh, shit. Okay, all right, all right. Your slap attack will send out shockwaves. Try to hop over those. Yeah, I know. I get it now. Here you go. Yep. None of my special can do anything here. Welcome back, Small Fry. Don't get comfy. We're gonna launch you again. Yeah, as long as Small Fry can't talk, he can't actually voice his complaints. Rule three, baby. For every time. So sad. Look, you just you need to go into the battles, man. The ink battles. Learn how to ink battle instead of just sitting in your mechs all the time. Ugh. No fair! Burger is way too strong! You put on a weak show, Octavio! Your set list is getting old! 
Maybe it's just you. Seriously, that was too easy. It's like you weren't even using the great Zapfish's power. Beautiful. I didn't steal the Zapfish this time. What? You didn't? But if it wasn't you, then who was it? We're about to find out. What the what? Ah, who's supposed to use? Ah! Ancient Three, help me! No! And all of my gear too! Shiver Fry? Big man? Uh, maybe they're not the culprits, but they definitely stood around at a very suspicious time. He's <laughs> more <Small friend. laughs> Whoa. Another underground facility. Splatoon 3. That was kind of cool little way for them to do the title card. Another underground facility, huh? Is this one gonna have been made by humans as well? I mean, you've got fucking... Plenty of things that look like they were made by humans and another- we got a giant rocket in the distance. Come on, little buddy. Hello! Hey! Oh, shit. Agent 3 over here! Whew! I'm so glad you're alright. Dude, Captain! You are Agent 3, right? Gramsfully enlisted you and your small fry? Yeah! Yeah, I knew it. I see the look in your eyes that he's always looking for. Well, it's nice to meet you. I guess we should introduce ourselves. I'm Agent 1 of the new Squid Beak, uh, uh, Squid Beak Splatoon. Hey, I'm Agent 2. Come on, Agent 2, get pumped! Anyway, one last crew member to introduce. This is our captain! <laughs> the captain's so nonchalant. We're the new, new Squid Beak Splatoon! <laughs> the little way that she dangles her hands together! <laughs> um, anyway, it looks how, like you and Gramps got separated in that fall. This place is huge and it's filled with that horrible fuzzy ooze stuff. And now we have to find Gramps before he, like, tastes it or something. Aw, you make it sound like he's, it's not gonna be fun. But seriously, please help us look for Gramps. So, uh... Yeah, I'm in! Oh, they're in. Probably just too excited about looking for someone else's grandpa to speak. <laughs> so, Gramps drilled in a new Agent 3. Glad to have you! <laughs> We've never been here before either, but here's the tour anyway. What do you think this place is called Alterna? Who knew it was beneath the crater this whole time? We count six different islands so far. What should we call them? Sites or something? Uh, are you even gonna mention the humongous rocket over there? Look at that! Way to steal my thunder. Anyway, we put a tracking device on Gramps, as one does. But now we're getting a strong signal from three different areas. Wah! Hey, Jesus, small fry. Hey, J3, your mission is to check out all three of those places. We upgraded your map a little bit. Tell us how much you love it. Now it tracks the places you've already visited, and lights up when you're near something interesting. Cool. Like when I'm nearby? Or buried treasure, I guess. We're here to look for Gramps, not treasure. And I hardly think Agent 3 needs a Cali tracker. Anyway... Wait! Agent 3 is totally out of power eggs! Did you lose them on the fall? Yikes! Your hero suit is all messed up, too. Oh, don't be dramatic. I mean, sure, Agent 3 will have to collect power eggs and upgrade from scratch. Hmm, I guess an explanation would help. First, they'll need Sardinium to unlock access to different types of upgrades. Then they can spend upgrade points to do the actual upgrading. There's gotta be some Sardinium down here in Alterna, right? If anyone can find it, it's Agent 3. Wait, did you tell Agent 3 how to actually get upgrade points? No? I'm on it. 
Ninja 3, just ink lots of stuff and find items. I guess it isn't rocket science, which is a shame because it seems like we might need some rocket science. Yeah, all right, there's a whole lot of stuff to deal with now. Never mind that for now. I'm gonna get a strong gramp signal from like the site next over. Go check it out. Yeah, yeah, I'm on it. So now we have like a hero upgrader. Thing. I guess we started off maybe fully upgraded. It's pulling a Metroid on us, isn't it? Where we like, we started off fully upgraded, but now we have to like go and get our shit back. So that's what that was. Get sensor. Automatically marks nearby enemies and enemies, or um, nearby items and enemies while you're submerged in ink. Although we didn't have this stuff. Curling bombs, burst bombs. Flat bomb. So we weren't really fully upgraded. Very interesting. Yeah, I don't think we had a skill. Oh, he's passed out. There's a camera. Hold up. I want, to, I want to get closer. I want to get closer. No, he's up. Hey, hey, little buddy. How you doing? How you doing, Captain? I'm not sure what to make of it, but the Captain says, You're always you, no matter what you look like. Oh, just so you know, the captain's kind of shy. Don't take the silence personally. Quick update, I just overheard the captain say, Wow, there's a lot going on in the new Squid Beaks platoon. Roll the battlefield from the captain. Keep an eye out for bombs in odd places. You never know. Roll the battlefield from the captain. Use R to look around. Keep that head on a swivel. <laughs> Roll the battlefield from the captain. Always look both ways before you cross. Yeah, you'll say that, but I'll forget it eventually. I'm here if you want to talk. Anything, uh, you want to talk about anything with someone who's barely paying any attention? What about you, Callie? Did you know you can jump back to any previous kettles directly from the menu? Solo albums are okay, but don't you think collabs are much more fun? I mean, I, I haven't really done any music things myself. Don't be shy with the ink. Splat everywhere. Fill up your upgrade point gauge and you'll get upgrade points. I'm splatting. <laughs> She's completely fucking covered. I love that the captain doesn't even try to block it. <laughs> Alright. Oh, legitimately splatting around gives you upgrade points. So I genuinely, it is genuinely in my best interest to cover fucking everything. Also, it's kind of amusing having, uh, the old Agent 3 as, like, the captain. And now we're, like, a new Agent 3. Because obviously, like, you know, they're saying, <laughs> we were that character at some point, you know? We used to be Agent 3. They are us. But now they're not. They're a whole different character. But we were there for their start. We were them at the start. Yeah, it'll probably be... <laughs> huh? What's up, small fry? Oh! Oh shit, these things can be invisible? Oh shit! 
Good to know. Uh, but I, what I was going to say is it might be better for us to, like, get upgrades first. So we don't really have a lot of inks, and our ink shooting is a little bit slow at the moment. So maybe we, we should get upgrades. Get our Sidonium and upgrade points first. Because I'm sure there's probably much faster ways to get upgrade points. Alright, get to know Alterna. Your only choice. Show off your skills and reach the goal. 